Hello everybody and welcome back to LLB Society. I'm Dr. Hariri, uh, the creator of LLB Society, which is a bilingual academy of English and Persian. And this time I'm going to narrate a short story from Aesop uh, entitled The Mouse and the Bull. And you can see it's a uh, post thumbnail or featured image. And I'm going to share the link to this short story in the description area so that uh, you could just study that in more depth if you want. All right, then you can learn some good vocabulary items here in this short story as usual. Okay, here we go. The mouse and the bull. A bull gave chase to a mouse which had bitten him in the nose. But the mouse was too quick for him and slipped into a hole in a wall. The bull charged furiously into the wall again and again until he was tired out. So charged here means stormed or attacked furiously, angrily. Uh, okay, into the wall again and again until he was tired out, he was exhausted and sank down on the ground exhausted or tired or fatigued with his efforts attempts. When all was quiet, the mouse darted out and bit him again. Dart out means to move very fast, to dash and to run very fast. And the mouse bit the bull again. Beside himself with rage or anger, rage means anger, he started to his feet. But by that time, the mouse was back in his hole again. And he could do nothing but bellow and fume in helpless anger. Bellow uh, it means to shout very loudly and to yell and moan angrily and fume in helpless, miserable rage or anger. Presently, means shortly, immediately, he heard a shrill little voice. Shrill means loud and uh, high-pitched usually voice say from inside the wall, and it was from the mouse actually, you big fellows don't always have it your own way. You see, sometimes we little ones come off best. It means that the size does not matter here and we little uh, people or creatures actually sometimes uh, happen to be stronger. Okay, and the uh, maxim or quotation or something that could be distracted, could be extracted actually from this short story is that uh, the battle is not always to the strong. This is the quotation which has become a, com a kind of a proverb in English. And this short story, uh, this uh, actually story falls into the category of English short stories with over uh, 100 English short stories. And also here are some tags or keywords. Aesop's fables, anger, battle, size, strength. And here's the author box. And you can also follow us for new lessons and related lessons. آموزش زبان انگلیسی با داستان کوتاه با ویدیو و نسخه فارسی. And uh, the boaster, the boasting traveler story from Aesop. And the lion and the three bulls. The stag and the pool. And the soldier and his horse. Here's the comment form where you can leave your questions and opinions uh, and expect to receive our responses very fast. And you can actually visit our website at elirbi.net, Elirbi Society, search for Elirbi Society on Google, Bing, etc. And uh, test all of our services free, try them free, try our, ser our services free before registration. Thank you so much for your attention and hope to see you soon in our next video.
Bye-bye, everybody.